What is going on, adventurers and draconians? Draco Invictus here with part 5 of our Neverwinter Road to 80 with our Gith rogue Draco in Githus. And uh, we are picking up right where we left off, and uh, we are here in Protector's Enclave. Um, let's see here, Sergeant Knox. Ugh. Alright, so we're gonna go meet Laris in the Sage Shop. And uh, we're going to knock out all these uh, real simple uh, quest lines. This is to uh, get our first artifact, even though we already have one, two actually. But uh, this is the first uh, normal game artifact that we will be getting. Not one that came from a pack or from a previous playthrough. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. I'm having a great day, as always. Sitting here playing Neverwinter. And what? What could she take? Is like fire, the tiniest. Okay. Oh, because we abandoned that quest. That's why. All right. You are the so we'll do that. Study. I have just and uh, we will get out of here. And we because we need that quest line when we go into uh, Black Dagger Ruins. Uh, that is. Um, our next zoned area. Of course, we are going to finish the link letter storyline. Well, not finish it, but advance it. Uh, that is first order of business here. And if you guys have missed um, playing through Black Lake and Tower District and uh, starting Acquisitions Incorporated, uh, starting that campaign, uh, I encourage you to go back. And, matter of fact, I will put a link up above right now <laughs> and uh, we will add that link and uh, to the playlist for the Neverwinter Road to 80 uh, so you can get caught up. Uh, the, if this is your first uh, video into the series um, understand that this is much more of a long play a long form uh, playthrough I have no I'm just following glitter here man I wasn't even paying attention um, yeah, this is a long form uh, playthrough, so uh, each episode is going to be about 45 minutes to an hour or so. I try keeping it under an hour, though. Um, one thing that we need to do claim our character rewards. I'm leaving the account rewards for my main right now, but we'll go ahead and get that open. Uh, taking a look through our bag, it looks like we have some treasure stuff in here. So before we go uh, bouncing over to Twallow the Bright's home, we'll come over here and visit a vendor, sell off some treasures, some old gear that we no longer need, and plus two smiting robes. Yep, those are gone. And, um, yeah, that's going to be it. So, now we will uh, come back into our inventory, sort that bag, just so it looks a little bit cleaner, and we will move on. And since we're right here at the gate, I will just go ahead and um, go that way instead of bringing up the old signpost. Wizard's Folly. Let's do it. Yeah, that's not a good sign, is it? Not a good sign at all. Ooh. Let's search the barrel. All right. Hoping for something cool, but. There we go. Another barrel to search. Please don't find me. Who just leaves random potions sitting in a barrel? Whatever. Yeah. 
This guy's home is really messed up. A GRU! Gotta remember the first time I heard that word, or read that word, GRU. It was in a video game that wasn't really a video game because there was no such thing as a video game at the time. It was a text-based game called Zork. Yep, because that's how old I am. I remember the original Zork. That coinage right there. Search his body. get the chest and we are clear all right you lazy bastard you did it yeah your boss is dead dagger of dueling dum 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 let's get that equipped right now uh, 79, so it's going to replace our offhand. There we go. The man cleaver is no man cleaver. <laughs> oh boy. And now back to Sergeant Knox we go. And then he's going to give us the next part. Alright, it's gonna drive me crazy. I just. Yeah, 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 sure. That way it goes away. In case anyone gets uh, the nerve to attack me, my daggers will protect me. Protectors on play, need your. This. What we found out about it. The Perloiner's Mask. Now we need to go to the Beggar's Nest. Spell burst. That doesn't sound good. If the book that killed Hi Joseph, let's go. Let's go find Razad. Ah, I wondered when I would Not on my watch, you bastard. There. Screw you in here, little crystals. Oh, that's a lot. I killed a thief foul spawn. Oh, I'm so sorry, Mr. Berserker. But you didn't even get to Berserk. Burst. Ah, get it?
No spell casting for you. You know, I have to say these sewers and pretty much all the sewers in Neverwinter are really, really clean considering they're sewers. We're safe from. I mean, yeah. No little turds floating around. It's great. Oh, I like the boom, boom, boom. I got two of them with it? I don't know who that guy is. I've never seen him before. Huh. That's different. Cool. All my years of playing this game. <sighs> Trap, flip the switch, get the treasure. Drop a little thanks to Timora for the treasure. Southpaw. <laughs> That's not very nice. And we don't have a dungeoneering skill kit. Come on, I could totally pick that from here. Alright, Southpaw. Whoa, where'd all the rest of you guys come from? Get everything? Stuck on a rock. How could he possibly, possibly, from this vantage point, see daylight ahead? Again. And it's sewers. I mean, aren't there sewer grades that would be shining daylight down? <sighs> this does not look like... I mean, okay, yes, there's daylight there. We got these people out. Linklater, I think you're lying. We got our Purloiner's Mask. Let's take a look at that really quick. 
Well, we definitely need to equip that. 176 awareness. I mean, honestly, at this point, it doesn't really matter. Let's open that up. Um, all right. And out we go. I'm just going to run over to the auction house really quick and just get this stupid quest. I mean, I get it. For new players, hey, here's the auction house. You'll never come here again. <laughs> I mean, because you won't. Unless you're doing pro uh, professions, in which case you'll end up talking to this chick here to uh, move your progressions forward. Welcome to the auction. But you'll never come over to the auction house. You can very simply go to store and the Tarmaloon Trade House. That's right there. The Tarmaloon Trade House is the auction house. You'll never come back there. So now we will just um, pull up our signpost and we are going to the Plague Tower. All right, people. All right Knox. Link yeah, that's it. Rush in there, Linkletter. It'll be your demise. I'm already here. Now, I'm curious. There used to be, like, little boxes and stuff. Oh, I pissed those guys off. I guess I'll just come over here and... Oh. Wow, look at that. Nox actually did something. Ah, see? Look. They do still have stuff sitting back over here. So for you lower level folks, don't just follow the glitter. Look around a little bit. Alright, Sergeant. Good luck. Now this one, you used to be able to kind of get your way through, but you can't now. Because it won't let you open the chest while you're taking damage. I know. Go figure, right? Now, if you had an arcane kit, then you could get rid of that little fire and open the chest. But I don't have one of those right now. Talk to the vendor, sell off some stuff. We're going to sell off the old man cleaver, the magic leather mask. Um, yeah. I found Dorothea! Alright, Linkletter. Stay there. Think he's gonna listen to me? Oh, hi, guys. Oh, bye, guys. It's a, little, it's a very handy AoE. Grew you. Ooh, easy there. Big fella. I uh, see. <laughs> he was trying to get all big. Trying to get all uppity. This guy's just gonna. <laughs> He's just gonna stand there and bleed. Alright, if you don't want me to spoil how to solve this riddle, look away now. Yes, the three statues facing forward. <gasps> oh no, I ruined it for you. Damn it! My apologies. Oh, 
All right, moving on. Hey, look, it's now plague touched link letter. Hmm. Wonder if that's not a little uh, foreboding there. Stay back! It was a trap. This isn't a trap, Joseph. It's an experiment. <laughs> ah, Razad, you dick. It's okay, Link Letter. Yeah, fall through the floor already. Don't you do that screaming shit at me. There is no way that should have followed me like that. Come on now. It's all your fault, Dorothea. It is. It's all her fault. Alright. Oh, I got that guy way back over here, too. Cool. He must have been closer and the gold just kind of flew that way, huh? It's kind of weird that she does the whole arms outstretch thing to get these little daggers going. Not very stealthy, is it? Hey, look at me! I do like her fight animations, though. I should have waited for him. Don't have a nature skill kit. Hey, look, we found Link Letter. You're not looking too good there, bud. Should have waited. Look at this guy over. He's over here, you know, trying to get everyone else all riled up. We're not as we were, but we're still together. Whatever you say, Dorothea, it's all your fault. Come on, all of y'all, come on over here. Come on. Take care of everyone at one time. All right. Wish you could turn these faster. And the little crystal light up. Ding. We have a winner. And we sure are scoring on that quartz, let me tell you. The loot tables for the lower level of the stuff is so funny. It just cracks me up. Alright, so we're back at where we started, except this gate's now open now. This is the same vendor we talked to before. Uh, we'll sell off our treasures again. And I guess that is all we need to sell off right now yes but now we're going to follow the finger that's a phrase that I don't think I've ever actually said 
follow the finger. Alright. You first. Need to pick up that thing. And ultimately we need to go that direction, but we need to come over here first. What's up, Hulk? Obviously he's not incredible. God, I need to stop. Down with the crew! That was like a Gru crew. Oh my god! <laughs> That's horrible! <laughs> I should unsub myself for that. <laughs> the crew crew. Didn't there used to be a spider or something down here? I knew there was a spider down here! Alright, that is everything that we need now. Back up the ladder we go. There's one more piece we need to pick up, but it is on this end. And I believe it's a head to one of the statues. Because these statues be broken, yeah. Or, was that a conch shell or something? I don't know what that is. Yeah, I guess they do have all their heads. But she needed her flowers back. We'll call her... Algernon. Oh, oh now I'm really going back. And she needs her, yeah, a cornucopia. Yep. And she needs her staff. A crone's staff. Let's get that straight right now. It's not a shepherd's crook. It is a crone's staff. Because there is no crook. Open the final secret door. More lore. More lore, more lore. Alright, now uh, we're going to go face Razad. Oh, it's never too late to stop you. Your ritual to become a god, was it? Those wizards always so damn power hungry. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they promised you. Hmm. How'd that work out for you? Alright, all that shit needs to get off my screen so I can see what the hell's going on. Man, he didn't even have a chance to transform. I kicked his ass. Alright. The Cloak of the Plague Terror. That is something that we definitely want to put on right now. Because the cruel amulet is just not good enough. Because the cloak at least gives us an offense slot. Oh, and I did go through... Um, I wanted to do that, too. Let's uh, come down to our mailbox. Went through one of uh, some of my characters and grabbed some different stones to use, some uh, enchantments as it were. 
I will go ahead and grab these green insignias. We'll grab that one as well. And I don't think we want any of this other uh, Maybe we want those? We'll go ahead and take them. Take those two. You see, you collect a lot of crap over the time. We'll take those two. May end up mailing these all back to myself. Sweet lord. We'll leave those, those. We'll take that. I may end up grabbing this, uh, the spiked Dionychus. It is a mount. And, um, and it is an epic mount. That might be kind of, uh... <clears throat> you know what, yeah, we'll go ahead and uh, take him for this character. And we will get rid of that mail. And if you guys are wondering how you can mail yourself stuff, you don't actually have to make it out to yourself. You just need your at. I may end up doing a uh, Neverwinter Basics video on this exact thing because this is a great way to store stuff. You have very limited storage space in the banks. This is a great way to store stuff until you need it. Um, I try and group things together uh, for similar, similar, so that, okay, potions. Okay, I need potions. Boom. I have one mail that uh, will get me potions. And now you will see that my inventory is a lot fuller now. And uh, I will sort through all of this stuff and figure out what we need, what we don't need. We'll go from there. All right, now I'm going to go talk to this General Brosh just to get that quest off my list. It's just to learn about the Dragonborn, like I said in a previous episode. Well done. There, done. Oh, I have to actually complete the quest, don't I? There we go. Oh, look at that. Return to Sergeant Knox at the Hall of Justice. Oops. I guess they need to fix that. He's no longer at the Hall of Justice. Protectors on play. You did the right thing in the plague talk. I know I did the right thing. Who are you kidding? Alright, so Black Dagger Ruins, Recover Order Documents. Yep, we are going to Black Dagger Ruins. Yeah, we got time. Uh, really quickly though, I do want to um, look through, let's see what we got here. We're going to be swapping out stuff pretty regularly, but I do want to at least uh, get some stuff in these slots. Uh, we will throw in, that's a rank 8, these are all rank 8s I think, that's a rank 7. Throw in this rank 8, that'll give us more power. Up here in the armor. Um, let's go with uh, hit points. So we will go with radiance in the defense slots as well for now. Now, ultimately, you want to get some utility slots. Uh, those typically come in the head, arms, feet, uh, waist, and uh, sometimes neck. So this is a defense slot. Let's go ahead and oh, it's an offense slot. Nice. Well, we'll throw in another rank eight. Get us some more power. This ring has an offense slot. We'll throw in another rank eight. Whatever enchantments you guys have, put them in. If you only have rank uh, rank threes, eh. but rank fives are easy enough to get, especially early on in the game. Uh, put them in get those extra points get what you can where you can that's always been my motto uh, with this game and as you start running multiple characters you're going to be picking up higher level stuff and you can move it around to different characters so let's get to it black dagger ruins oh one other thing that we wanted to look at really quick um is in our mounts uh we're going to go to our stable we're seeing here that we need two regal insignias we don't have any 
Um, let's go back. Um, we still don't have a regal, so that won't. We can't put anything there. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> finally we have all those insignias and no regals to slide in there to start getting some more insignia bonuses. Um, so yeah, we will uh, move on. We're gonna meet seven toes. I don't know if normally he has eight or six. I, I don't know why seven toes. What but. could I do for you? So, you're the one the old sergeant sent to help well, us poor harpers, eh? He looks human, so... My partner, a tiefling wizard. Alright, so we're going to examine dead bodies along the road. Fair enough. That's not her. I, I don't know why. I just, can't I just go to her? Do I have to do this? Yes, I have to do this. That's not her. No kidding, really? I could have told you that. Looks like someone already came in and... That's not her! Alright, now we need to go talk to old Lynn. This guy's a crotchy little bastard, too. What? I... You know... Get our quests and roll on. Guess we're doing light the beacons first. But we're also going to knock holes in bandit boats since we're over here. Tiny Bubbles. Nice name. I like original names like that. Come on. Thank you. You are not going to drink a potion. Not happening, dude. Is there a boat down there? No. Up here. I missed that guy totally. Wow. That's a hell of a beacon, like streaking up like that. That's crazy. Defend the booty. Always gotta protect the booty. Knock a hole in the boat. Alright. Done. So we are looking for four more boats. Looks like that guy's got that well in hand. Moving on to boat number four. Ah, 
I am the Bandit Slayer. Alright, another boat. The boat number five. There's boat number six. And now we need to light one more beacon, which is right there. Come on. We've been looking for her. Well, look, there she is. Huh. Shocker of shock. Go to see an the end of I am the black. Alright, get orders. Kill kill salvagers. Salvagers. I just wanted to kill them. Alright, um let's see here. Some of the orders are right up here. We're also looking for a salvager. Her orders. Sniper, huntsman. Nope. What salvager? That's an enforcer. No, you're dead. And we have a chest up there. Let's get to that. There we go. Thank you, Taimora. Salvager, there we go. Ah! Misplace my big knife thing. I lose, you lose. There's a salvager. Four out of five. Four out of five salvagers recommend anyone other than me killing them. And the fifth one just hasn't met me yet. Now it's five out of five. All right, let's get this done. So we got um almost all of her equipment. There's one more piece. We're missing her supplies. So we need to go grab that. And I'm hoping that the weather's been kind of weird here today, so I'm hoping that nothing gets a little wonky. I'm not in combat. I don't know what you're talking about. Alright, so return to her for salvaging salvagers, or savaging salvagers. Excellent. Turn that in, that in, the sea Rain caves. One of the we have to go kill Hexbane. But before we do that, I'm gonna come in here and grab this 
thief skill node. Need that white pearl. You know how it is. Pearls gotta have pearls, right? Come on down here to the sea caves. I could ride my mountain here. It won't let me. I swear they do it just to slow the player down. Ah, oh, there's a lot of guys right there. Like seven or eight of them? Nice. We'll take the map. We'll come back here. Hit this skill node. Another white pearl. See, I'm gonna have a full necklace soon. So I can sell it. It's over. It's only just begun. And now it's over. Sorry. Has a crazy chest. Wow! <laughs> Holy hell! Let's pause for just a quick moment here. Take a look at all this crap we just picked up. So this is definitely recommended. We're going to slot that in for the Dagger of Dueling. Okay, the piercing gloves of protection. Yep, we're going to put that on. Restoring Belt of Agility. Yeah, gonna put that on. Plus three pairing armor. It's deflection or deflection. Now, I'm not gonna put this on. Let me explain why. This pairing leather armor does not have a defense slot. Okay, so while it is technically a higher item level, the lower item level is actually giving me more... Uh, hit points because it does have that defense slot that I have an enchantment slotted into. So I'm not going to put that on. Now the piercing gloves, um, these actually have a utility slot. So I'm I, even though I just put on the other gloves over here, I am going to put these on. And I'm going to go into my character sheet because I want to put in is 8 the highest one I have? it looks like it is no actually I'm going to put in a dragon horde in my utility this will give me a 4% chance after killing a phone to find a gemstone at your feet multiple copies of this enchantment increase the chance of a find um, I will also, in some utility slots, I will be slotting in the Azure enchantments because they give a bonus to XP. Uh, that way I'm leveling up a little bit quicker. And, um, yeah. So I can get to some of the more cooler encounter powers and stuff like that. But, for now, we're just going to go ahead and uh, pick that. And then, in this slot, we're going to put in another rank 8 enchantment for even more power. All of our... Oh. I was going to say all of our slots are done, but they are not. So we are going to slot in. Uh, we're going to slot in another rank 8 here. 
see awareness um, awareness deflection critical avoidance let's just go for the hit points huh there we go man fighting that mimic was very advantageous am I going the wrong way what what oh what where am I going and yes I was going the wrong way I didn't need to go back this way Because this is where we just fought that mimic. We just needed to keep passing through. Come on over here. Oh. I went all the way back for an insignia. Are you kidding me? Oh well. Oh, Marion. There you are, Marion. I want your hat, actually. Actually, your whole outfit would be very, very cool. It would look great on me. Why did that trigger on that guy, and not on her? Blicker sight. Fair enough. Anything good in here? I think there's maybe something over here. There is. All right, so we got that. We can now get the flock out of here. All right, so we need to go back to her. And then we need to go talk to old Len and turn in the quest that he gave us. And then we're going to wrap up this episode. So. Good to see the end of the Hexbane's death. All right, Hex now we have to go find Mr. Gold Seeker. After we go talk to old Len. I think he has another quest for us too, but but for now we're just going to trot our happy butts over to old Len and get this turned in. Cause we don't found rope. Yep. That'll be the last quest that we have for him, I believe. Yeah, see, they still have the contest here, but they don't have it in the Tower District anymore. Very interesting. Okay. Um, so, we've got mail. Let's see what that mail is. Uh, head back to headquarters. So, it looks like we have more to do over at Acquisitions Incorporated. We will pick that up in the next episode. Uh, let's go through our inventory really quickly here. Um, see what our new stuff... So the sash is same item level as what we're wearing, but it doesn't have the uh, open slot, so we're going to pass on the Corsair sla Corsair's sash. Now the... Alright, we're going to move away from him because he won't shut up. Now, as I was saying, the armor over here... Gives us more deflection, more hit points, more power, all of those things, and has the slot. So we'll go ahead and equip that. 
and we will remove this radiant from here and that is a lesser armor lesser power armor kit that I don't think we're going to use right now there we go taking a look at our stats really quick 35,000 uh, hit points that's pretty good 10,000 power 18,000 combat advantage half of that combat advantage is racial abilities which is crazy um, so yeah we are clicking along and uh, we will pick up right here in the next episode if you guys get any questions comments kicks or complaints go ahead and leave them down in the comment section below um, I make sure to answer every question and um, if you leave me a funny comment or something like that I will typically reply to that as well I appreciate you guys coming out and uh, stay tuned here if you're new sub hit the bell notification icon this is gonna be a long series so stick around uh, we've got more great content coming out and until next time you take care of yourselves out there this is Drake one Victor saying this has been the greatest day of my life see ya <laughs>